Hey everyone, welcome to this week's video. So right here, I'm gonna show you how to create a form with Typeform. What's amazing about Typeform is one, it makes really, really beautiful forms, but also two, it makes really, really easy to use surveys and let's say you wanna do an application for a program or a product, Typeform is kind of my go-to for that. So right now I'm just gonna log into Typeform. And we're also assuming that you have all your questions ready to go and planned out. And it's just a matter of doing the techie part of making something happen. So let's go ahead and log in here. And there's a lot of things that you can do here. One second. Okay, so here I am logged in. So now I can see, you can see I already have some, some things already set up here. What we're gonna do today is we're gonna create a new type form. And you can either start from scratch or they have some really fun um, templates already ready to go. What I love about these templates is they make it really, really easy for you. So I'm actually gonna do membership application. So let's see. They go apply now, and then they have all the questions, and obviously we need to add some questions, but I like the template overall. So I'm gonna use this template. And here's where I can add in my questions. Now this works like a lot of the other kind of survey things that you've used before. It's pretty much, you can add blocks, whatever you would like them to be. You can do ratings, you can do drop downs, you can do text. Um, here we have different options for you now. And you can add in your different questions. So let's say I wanted to add in a yes or no question. I can put it in here and say, do you, do you like, puppies. Not that that's required. And the answer can be yes or no. Um, I can make it required. I can add a description to it. Just wanted to know for fun. I can add variables. So that if someone says yes, it then goes here. I can add an image. I can add video. I can do a lot of fun stuff. So it saves pretty much automatically you might want to go here and just change the name so that you know what it is and then i can go view and bam here's my type form now i can embed this type form i can leave it just as this link to send people right here and i can hit apply now and then they just go in this is what makes it so pretty it's just absolutely gorgeous I'm an administrative, that sounds very boring, but that's okay. I do like puppies. Okay, cool. And then submit. And now the responses are gonna get emailed to me, which is really, really awesome. So that's a little bit of how you create a type form. There's a lot of different ways. And then once I get in here, I can see the results. I can share it. They give you different options. I can connect it. So this shows me how many people came in. I can create reports from this. I can show the individual responses and different, different statistics. I can get on the share. This is where I can get the embed code to embed it into your website. This is the link. I can share it on social media. I can add some SEO if I want. I can put this into an email as well. This is the embed code if you want it to be on your website. And again, really, really easy if I wanna play around with this a little bit. This is the email, if I wanna just go ahead and email it to someone. And then if I wanna check out kind of the different ways to integrate it, I can integrate it with different MailChimp, Google Sheets, Google Analytics, like there's a lot of different in, uh, integrations that I can do as well. I can do webhooks, which is similar to an integration, but it's 
really just hooking one application to another because there's a lot of different things that I can do with this. And that's a little bit about Typeform. If you have any questions, just let me know. Bye everyone. Thank you.